Many of us, uh, Doc, don't um, realize that we probably have poor dental habits. Yes. Uh, maybe you can highlight some of those so that, you know, maybe it can click that perhaps this is what I do on a daily basis and it's really not good for my teeth and gums. Okay. Mm. All right. So uh, I think the one that most people are guilty of is just using your teeth to open things. You know, I want to open these. I, I mm -hmm. use my, yeah. So sometimes it might actually crack your tooth mm -hmm. and um, especially if it's a, it might not be at the time you do it, but with time, you know, and then uh, sometimes they're grinding, you know, when people, you know, I'm angry, I'm, you know, grinding mm -hmm. my teeth and some, and maybe at night people don't realize it. Um, so this will, it has a detrimental effect on the teeth. And then um, uh, obsessively brushing your teeth, you know, aggressively you want to get the dirt out mm -hmm. or you're thinking the harder I brush, the more it will help me or, you know, you're doing it like multiple times a day. This will actually have more um, negative effect than a positive thing. Oh. And then, of course, you know, habits mm -hmm. like biting your nails mm -hmm. um, and, you know, such things. Or with time, it will actually start to chip your teeth. Yeah. On the other side, well, we talked about uh, uh, parents. You know, there are things like when, you're, when you watch your child is like, um, you know, uh, chewing their, uh, I mean, like sucking their thumbs and mm -hmm. uh, or your, their fingers, you know, using um, these pacifiers for a long period of time, that can actually have a detrimental effect on, no, on the children and also on the grown-ups, you know, mm -hmm. you have to, yeah. Mm -hmm. yes. 